what did you eat for breakfast today? In our last episode of Mastering Town Hall 9, I realized that I needed a new base design, so we grabbed this OP base, and it has been doing work so far. Today, we have to attack with some witches, as promised as well. Let's go to war. What is up, my friends? My name is Echo, and I'm excited to be back with episode 10 of Mastering Town All Night. I can't believe we have 10 episodes in the books already, but we are going to be rocking this new base. I've been really liking it, guys. It's been it's held two defenses so far. If we take a look right here, you'll see a 58% two and a 77% two as well. We're in war right now. They don't even want to hit this base. Where am I? Look at this. Check this out, they've completely ignored my base. So as I promised last episode, we need to attack with these witches today. We're gonna come in with a little bit of an old school witch slap strategy, just, you know, in, in Crystal League. And then we're gonna check out the war and go in on a war hit utilizing the hogs that we've struggled with so much in war. We gotta try and get it done today. What do you guys think? Can we do it? Let me know in the comments below. Also throw a like, and if you guys love this channel, if you like hanging out with me, Sub it, ring the bell. We have daily clash videos for you right here. So let's go try to find a base. And while I go on this hunt, we'll take a look at some of your comments. Guys, I've been coming into so many Town Hall 10s while trying to farm that I think I need to drop trophies. I think I need to go down to like Gold 1 or Crystal 3 and try to find bases that are a little bit better for me with some loot because the Town Hall 9s, they never have loot here. So maybe that'll be our next episode. Check out these goblin socks. You can see right through the goblins. Oh, a Town Hall 11, how nice. I do not want to hit this base. Definitely not. And it seems like I found a base that is hittable. Something that I could actually attack, get a decent amount of loot, and it's still a Town Hall 9. Okay, the Queen is down. It's only a level 15 King, so that's going to be kind of nice as well. With the Witch Slap, we're going to get going on straight through the base. We have two jump spells to do it. So we're going to go with three Witches in the corner. And we're going to go with two Healers. I think I went with four. And we'll go with three here. We'll go with all the Witches on the outside of the base. Then a Golem, a Golem, King... Queen, a couple of wizards for funneling as well. And pretty soon, we're gonna be setting this jump spell in the clan castle. We have those Valkyries just like we've been using in the hog rider attacks we've been doing as well. So we're gonna get these troops in there. We're gonna rage everything up once they do get in. Come on now, get on in there. I'm saving my other jump just in case I need help getting things through. And here we go, we're gonna jump right into the core of the base as well. And then we have that heal spell, healing up everything as they get into the core. Get on in there. I'll tell you what, guys. Witch Slap is pretty darn strong, if you uh, if you ask me. The witches are still on the outside of the base, doing a good job. I can get a wizard over here. Oh, nope. That was a bad wizard placement. Get in there, queen. Jump in, please. Oh, she finally did. Wow. That took her long enough. But the king's ability, we pop that. He's going to clear out the core of the base. The queen's in there as well. King, barbarians, golem tanking in the core. Queen takes down that town hall. Let's go. Can we, do we have enough in the tank here, though, to pull in the triple? Which is they died on out in the in the outside of the base. They are no longer uh, a thing. They're kind of gone. But the queen has that golem tanking, and that could be huge for the end of this attack. The wizard's going to take down that air defense, really narrowing things down in this base. Valkyries are healed up, but those witches, they need the healers. Oh, no, don't run with the Valkyries. Oh, my goodness, no. That means our witches may be going down. Let's see. Let's see. Queen, she's still okay. We're going to have to pop her ability right here. She's being targeted by that archer tower. Witches are still somehow staying safe while the golem and Valkyries are being targeted. Take down that cannon. Let's go. Skeletons going around the outside of the base. The queen is still up. There's only these defenses left, and I have a wizard left in my back pocket. There's nothing in the corners except for that top corner. Healers go down, the queen is being healed up, and that's going to be amazing for the tail end of this attack. Let's get her through with a little bit more health. Valkyries are going to run on through as well. We can even drop this wizard in when everything is distracted, which is right now. We'll take out that cannon. Uh, rip. 
that cannon will take out me. We'll, we'll change that around. But it looks like Witch Slap is pulling in a triple for me, even with those low-level heroes. Now, yes, of course, they have the same level hero. No clan castle. Queen was sleeping. It's all good. We still grabbed the 100%. Got some decent loot. But hey, we got the star bonus. Well, my, my queen, she's all ready to go. Where is my king? I don't even remember on this base. No, I'm right, I'm right here. You know, new base designs. You ever just get lost and not know where everything is? So not only do we have the loot in the base, we also have our loot cart, which, uh, you know, you got to grab your loot cart. Don't forget about that, boys and girls. Now we are going to come collect our dark. And let's see, we got some wall over here. This wall could definitely use the upgrade. So we'll just upgrade it over and over until it's max level. And I'm still going to be using the gold because elixir is for research and that's what we're trying to keep it for select the row okay well that works i guess you know it never selects the right row that i'm looking for when you hit select the row here we go again and again boom here we go and now just this guy let's get it done one two three four five nope six seven it's looking pretty strong. And if you remember, we're still working on that jump spell. We need to get that jump to 40 seconds. It's going to be massive on the attacks because right now, jump spells only last for me for 20 seconds. We're gonna train up a second army. We're gonna quick train it up right now. And it's going to be another hog rider attack because it's gonna be used in war. Now, I'm bringing along a skeleton spell as well to deal with one of those heroes. So if we train troops and brew spells, we're gonna add a skelly spell. In the clan castle, I'm asking for the Valkyries, the Giants, and of course that poison spell. Where is my CC? We need to request it right now. Let's actually say for war. Shall we add an emoji? Smiley face. Keep it positive, right? And we got the family saying what's up to YouTube. You gotta love the guys over here in Scrappy Nines. Maybe you guys would wanna come through if you do want to. Come through the Discord server linked below. Go to looking for a clan and Macy is barking. No, that's not Macy. That's Mocha. Maybe you want to meet Mocha. She's never been on the channel. And this is Mocha, guys. She's never been on the channel before. Her first appearance, Mocha is a Chihuahua Jack Russell mix, and she is 10 years old. She's not Macy. She's Mocha. It was so loud. Oh, it's so loud. So it's time to look at the war base that I'm gonna hit so we can go over it together and then I'm gonna do that attack. And again, we're gonna be doing it with hogs and it's not my favorite base to hit, I'll be honest. It's gonna be hard to funnel things into this base. It's kind of like an anti-hog style base. I, I get the feeling my troops are gonna go on the outside, but we're gonna try it anyways. I'm gonna come on in right here with my jump spell. What I need to do is get the heroes into the base with the Valkyries, lure the clan castle, take out the clan castle, and then on the back end of the attack over here, I'm gonna use a skeleton spell to try and help take down that queen as the hogs path themselves around. I see this as being difficult to grab three stars on. I wish that I had two jump spells, but we do need the extra heal as well, so we're gonna give it our best shot, and I'll tell you what, I am not at all feeling confident. And now before we get into the war attack, I figure you guys may wanna see how well my base defended. Now let's check this out. They're coming in with the new zap spell. So that's kind of cool. Using the zap spell, taking out one, two air defenses and then sending in all of the dragons. Now the attacker here, Simone, kind of went wide with those dragons, coming in with the healers and the queen too. I'll be honest, they just spammed everything in. Maybe not the best attack. Spamming in the king and queen with a bunch of healers, dragons just spread randomly around the base. I think that Simone needs to watch my YouTube channel more on the how-tos, but maybe not my attacks because mine probably look just identical to this. There's one freeze spell left, 22, 23 heroes. You know, Simone should have been able to come on through and, and beat this base if done properly, but really, it's that's the problem. It's not done properly. Dragons are all on the outside. It looks like the king is making his way around towards that expo compartment, but when he gets out of range, the expo is going to start targeting the healers instead. Dragons are doing a decent job taking down the enemy king, or my king, which is not really the enemy, but will the queen grab the town hall? It looks like she won't the queen is gonna go down to my king oh no no she did get it done oh my goodness now she's working on the town hall but she's gonna fall short on that i think yeah she is 
There's a lot of dragon power. They're coming through my little secret Tesla farm, which now I guess is not a secret anymore. Remember, we did get this base from Clash Champs from their champ base division. If you guys ever want bases, you can head on over there. And we are partnered with them right now on the channel, which is pretty darn amazing, guys. Dragons on the town hall. The other dragons are coming through as well on the town hall. They're going to make their way over there. Oh, man. They, this was, like, really close to only being a one-star, but that solo dragon was able to come through and clean some stuff up. And... She's making noise out there again. So let's double time through this before it gets crazy loud in the room outside of where I am right now. And you'll see that we did hold to a 70, mid 70% defending against the drag zap, which just was, like I said, spammed into the base. So not so bad. The king is up and ready to go. We're ready for war. We're gonna have to hope for a little bit of luck. Uh, yeah. So we need to come in with the wide funnel. I need to get my troops into the base. So this is going to take a little bit longer. So it's going to start out with a golem here and a golem here. We're going to go with a bunch of wizards behind and a bunch of wizards behind. So yeah, that's starting out decent. We're going to get the poison spell, which the wizards should help deal with. There is a witch there as well. So we definitely need that, uh, that to start getting worked on. The funnel is being set fairly decently though, I think. Um, maybe not. We still have a baby dragon to deal with. And there's still the witch, so that's a problem. That's a problem in itself. Let's see now, is the king and queen going to be dealt with? Come on, king, get on that there. Queen's going to have to deal with this. Oh my goodness. Popping that. Queen is going to get beaten up hard. Oh, will she even get into the base? We got to put a jump and get, the, and get the clan castle troops going in right here. There we go. So at least that's happening. They're going on into the base. We're going to be able to narrow things down at least a little bit. We lost a couple of Valkyries to the traps. We're going to pop the queen um, pretty soon. Pretty soon that's going to happen. Will she go with the kill squad? No, she's going to go the other direction. So let's go like this. We're coming in with all the hogs right over here. I have nothing to grab that town hall, unfortunately. Because the queen, when the king and the kill squad, well, they didn't make their way over there. We're going to go with this, with the skeleton spell there. We're going to heal up right through this area here. Maybe the skeletons and they can take out the queen. They are beating her up pretty good. Will it, will it be enough? We're going to go with the two of those. And we're going to then get the hog riders continue pathing through the base. The queen did go down. Oh, my goodness. It worked. It has worked. Giant bomb. We got the heal spell there, though. Those hogs should get healed up. Yes, they are. Guys, this is looking mighty fine right now. We have two eyes as well. Two people are watching. Will we be able to get this base done? Oh my goodness. It's gonna come down to time. That's what it's going to come down to right here. Oh, giant bomb. We didn't lose them though. We're gonna go with the heal spell right there. Oh my gosh, there's not going to be enough time. We've gotten all of the defenses down in the base, but I have nothing to get into the core to grab the town hall. It's all going to be right now. No, no. This is the best we've done in war yet, but it's still going to result in a one star because of the time. Man, unless if we can get those minions, if we can clean up enough and get the minions in the town hall, but it's still not going to... I feel like my army camp is just not big enough i feel like i just don't have enough troops rest in peace the frustration guys will hogs ever be a way for me to triple in war i feel like we're so close we're getting closer every time we're figuring it out the skeleton spell took down the enemy queen that was pretty epic but at the end of the day it's going to be a low 70 percent one star because the kill squad never got into the core of the base to take down the town hall and the heroes or nothing for cleanup really stayed alive them everything is gone man one of these days it's gonna happen it's gotta happen we have one more war attack to do, and we're going to do that later on today, but my base still lies on attack. Will we win this war? 25 hits out of 50 for 53 stars. They've only done 20 out of 50 for 43 stars. I don't know, guys. Are we going to win? We're going to have to bring you guys the results of this war in a future episode. Maybe in episode 11? I'm not sure. You know, who knows what we're going to do in episode 11, but that it's going to be fun. And, well... You better stay tuned, guys. You're going to want to be in here for that. But we need to request some troops. So let's go ahead and for war. And never forget to always head over to your dark village and just simply collect your gems. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I'm sorry I didn't pull in a three star for you guys. I have been trying so hard. 
the day will come. And you know what? What do we have here? My queen, to upgrade her, 50,000, we have 40,000, so we're almost there. We'll be able to get her to level, what is it? 16, pretty soon. That's gonna be happening, probably in the next episode of Mastering Town Hall 9, but we're out of here for today. Hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you check out a recent video and the entire series of Mastering Town Hall 9 right here. Have a great day, guys, and be good.